With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, so the question is solve the equation that is 3x cube minus 26x square plus 52x minus 24 equals to 0 while it is given the roots being in GP that is geometric progression. So let's see the solution here. So simply we have to solve this equation while it is given the roots are in GP. Okay, so what we will do that is we will do let. Uh, okay, first of all, we will write the given equation here that we have given uh, 3x cube minus of 26x square plus 52x minus 24 is equals to 0. Now, let's suppose the roots are a divided by r comma a and a r. Why I am considering the three roots here? Because the equation is x cube. Okay. So, as we know, the roots of equation can be equated as that is, if you will try to say the product of roots, okay, the product of roots can be given by, it will be equals to A divided by R into A into AR, this should be equals to minus D divided by A. So, what is minus D? So, the constant term is nothing but the value of d here which is minus 24. So, minus minus get plus 24 divided by a is nothing but what? That is 3. So, it will be 24 divided by 3. So, from here if you see, so rr get cancelled a into a into a will become a cube is equals to 3 at the 24. This implies a will a cube will be equals to 2 cube. This will be equals to how much? That is 2. So, here we one root we got as what? That is 2. Okay. Now, similarly, we know that the sum of root is nothing but is equals to how much? That is a divided by r plus a plus r a r. This is equals to. Now, what are the sum of root? That is minus b divided by a. So, it will be equals to now if you see. So, b is nothing but minus 26 minus minus get plus 26 divided by a is what? That is 3. Okay. So, if you substitute the value of a here as 2, so it will become 2 by r plus 2 plus twice of r is equals to 26 divided by 3. Now taking 2 to that side, this will become, uh, while we take 2 as a common, so it will become 1 upon r plus r, this is equals to 26 divided by 3 minus of 2, 3 to the 6, 26 minus 6 will become 20 divided by 3. So what we got here that is 2 in bracket 1 upon r plus r is equals to 20 by 20 by 3. Now we can cancel out that is 2 and the 2, 2 10 the 20. So simply what we get that is 1 upon r plus r it is nothing but is equals to 10 divided by 3. Okay. Now doing the cross multiplication. So it will simply become 1 plus r square multiply by 3 this will be equals to 10 times of r if you form the equation here. So it will be like 3 r square uh, plus 10, 10 times of r will come to this side becomes 3 r square minus of 10 r plus 3 is equals to 0. Now this equation can be break like uh, 3 r square minus 9 r minus of r plus 3 is equals to 0. If we take 3 r as common, so it will remain r minus of uh, 3 3 is a 9 that is minus 3 minus of 1 common. So it will remain r minus 3 is equals to 0. r minus 3 will be common. So in another bracket we will get uh, 3 r minus 1 is equals to 0. This implies r will be equals to 3 or r will be equals to 1 by 3. So here actually we are getting r having the two values that is 3 and 1 by 3. So, finally, on putting these values in this a by r, a and a r, so that we get the required roots, that is, here simply we can say that the roots of equation will be how much, that is what we have a divided by r, comma r and a r, this is not r, this is a. So, on putting the value of a and r here, so it will become 2 divided by 3, comma 2, comma 2 into 3. This implies it will become 2 divided by 3 into 2 into 6. 
so this is the required roots of equation so this is the required solution thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today